Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How can I use GIS in Google Earth for property searching? To begin your property search using GIS, Geographic Information System, and Google Earth, you need to understand the various tools and features available. Using GIS for property search. GIS systems often provided by local counties offer detailed information about properties. You can search for a property using the tax ID number, parcel number, property ID number, owner's name, or address. For example, if you are searching for a property in McDowell County, North Carolina, you would type Null McDowell County GIS Null into your search engine to find the specific GIS website for that county. Once on the site, use the search function, typically represented by a magnifying glass, to input your search criteria. If the property has a full address, you can copy and paste it into the search bar. Navigating GIS systems. If the property does not have an easily identifiable ID number, you can use other details from the MLS listing, such as the deed book and page number, or follow the directions provided in the listing to locate the property on the GIS map. For instance, if the directions say to take a specific route and turn onto a particular road, you can use the measure tool in the GIS system to measure the distance and pinpoint the property's location. Using Google Earth for property search, Google Earth is a powerful tool for visualizing properties. To use it, you can start by downloading Google Earth Pro, which offers advanced features such as importing and exporting GIS data and accessing high-resolution historical satellite imagery. Adding parcel lines to Google Earth. To add accurate parcel lines to Google Earth, you can follow a step-by-step -step process. First, double-click on the property in Google Earth to copy its address or GPS coordinates. Then open Google My Maps and create a new map. Paste the address or GPS coordinates into the search window and zoom in to see the property. Use the Draw tool to trace the parcel boundaries shown on the map, save the layer, and then export it as a KML or KMZ file. This file can be opened directly in Google Earth to display the parcel lines. Visualizing property details. Google Earth Pro allows you to create detailed maps, import ESRI shapefiles, and draw polygons or points. You can also use the 3D view and other layers to get a comprehensive look at the property. For example, you can remove the 3D buildings layer to get a flat view or use the historical satellite imagery to see changes over time. Finding property lines on Google Maps. If you need to find the exact boundaries of a property, you can use Google Maps. Enter the property's address into Google Maps, switch to the satellite view, and zoom in until the property lines appear. However, note that this information is not always available, and for more accurate results, you may need to review the property survey or check with your local clerk's office for the plat map. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.